Executive Vice President of the National Rifle Association. You may not hear it from the media, but the NRA has a proud history going back 135 years. Our members have included American presidents, Civil War generals, Medal of Honor winners, and freedom-loving people just like you. Millions of Americans dedicated to the Second Amendment right to keep and bear arms in defense of life, liberty, and property. Find out who we are and what we do through the key pages accessible here. Thanks for visiting, and please come back often. Shortly after 1 o'clock in the afternoon, Success Tech Academy was under a code blue alert. The school was under attack from a 14-year-old student. Witnesses say Asa Kuhn was dressed in black with a gun in each hand when he opened fire. At approximately 8.36 a.m., our department began receiving multiple telephone calls from inside Louisiana Technical College on North Acadian East of shots fired inside the building. Uh, the call was dispatched one minute later at 8.37, and by 8.40, three minutes after dispatch, we had officers on the scene. Whoa! Just shocking video there. You can hear the gunfire ring out in it. Just to let you know, this takes us to the scene of what happened there on the Virginia Tech campus. The fact is, we had one individual that obviously had some problems that came to our campus and actually engaged in a serious act of violence. Yesterday I was asked how many shots did he fire. Well, I can't tell you exactly how many shots he's fired, but I can tell you that we found 48 casings and six shotgun shells that were expended. I think it would be inappropriate for me to say anything other than I hope the American people will be praying for the students, the parents, and the teachers. And uh, we'll wait for events to unfold, and then uh, there'll be more to say. Actually ran off campus. Now, they were able to apprehend that shooter. They do believe it is another student somewhere nearby. They have that shooter in custody. The uh, victim right now at a local hospital, they are saying, in serious condition. The all-clear has been sounded after a student was shot on the campus of the University of Arkansas at Little Rock. I think this is very, very crazy. It's like the fourth college shooting. It happened in Virginia, then it happened in Northern Illinois like a week ago. It's getting crazy. What do you see as the biggest challenge? And you, you kind of touched on it, but he said, in one word, he said complacency. That is his biggest concern. Well, yeah, I mean, it's, uh, you know, I mean, it's, it's no different than anything else. I mean, if you're a politician in this country that wants to destroy the Second Amendment, if you look over to our side and, 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 and you see weakness, I mean, you go, hey, maybe I'll take a run at those guys. Maybe I can pull it off. On the other hand, if we're four, five, six million members and growing. And that grassroots membership is really the best thing about the NRA. I mean, that's where our clout comes from. And uh, so if that's growing, you go, eh, I don't want to mess with those folks, you know. It, uh, I mean, they'll, they'll fight back and, uh, and, and, and it'll hurt when they do.